of a Victorian swimming uh, entertainment center that was very large. It covered the whole area of water there with swimming pools that were heated from ocean water. It was very popular and they had a museum inside and occasionally they would convert it to a roller skating rink or a, maybe even an ice skating rink. And now it's just become ruins. It's overtaken with lots of vines. Um, some native plants but a lot of invasive species. But it's very interesting. It's a mixture of natural setting and history. California history. Another ship. Yeah, another one coming in. Yeah, no. That one's weird because it doesn't have any casinos on it. The one that's up. That one right there. Even though that looks like a tent, the steps, I think it'll be easier to walk down than to cut across this path here because it's not it's like a whole. Okay, it's I guess that's it. I guess that's it. I'll bring a couple of water. Thank you. Welcome to Sutro Baths, San Francisco. Bottom here are the support structures for the building that was Sutra Baths. You can see the columns sticking up. I'm glad I brought my windbreaker. Oh, yeah. I had a clue, that's why I wanted to get all buckled up in this. Oh, he's got a gummy. She baffles him. Chuck's well, too, right? Oh, nice. <laughs> So 
is this like uh, ocean? Yeah. This, ocean. Is, this is technically called Ocean Beach. Yeah, on that yeah. side. This is Land's End. Land's End. So I need you in front of me so that I know that it's not too slippy, you know. Oh. And the worst case scenario, I lose my balance and uh -huh. crash into both of you. Well, it's very I slippery saw that. now. Okay. Yeah, it's going to get better, but this is the worst part right here. Yeah. It's just slippery rocks. Okay. That dog is a riot, isn't oh, it? It's so, <laughs> so why don't we stop here and tell me something about um, this whole bathhouse thing? And how about talking about the ships that are out there? I don't know about them. Okay, how about you, Monica? Do you know that yeah, ship? Shipping containers coming from the Pacific Ocean <laughs> and probably China. I'm going to walk down the path to the base of Sutro Baths and we're going to go into the Cave of Wonders which has a nice little tide pool and uh, an area for viewing the waves. So come along with us. We have this endangered animal here that's doing nothing and we're going to pick it up and we're going to move it over here. <laughs> we might get fights. We might be crying. <laughs> Isn't it amazing all the stuff he got? What were you saying about this, Monica? She just likes the flowers. Okay. This is edible miner's lettuce. Hmm. That's what the miners ate when they mm -hmm. were digging for gold. <laughs> helps helps with irritable irritable bowel syndrome. <laughs> I don't know what this sign is. Or IBS. You be what? IBS is the. Uh, I'm kidding. Oh. <laughs> it's nice and fresh, the air. I like yeah, the. Yeah, it's good. <sighs> good, healthy walk after a meal. This is maintained by the uh, state parks and recreation. And they maintain the flowers and the upkeep of all the, of the horticulture at the Sutra Bath. <laughs> That's a, a, a new coming observation tower oh, yeah. right there, which is under construction probably for 2014. And uh, it's going to have a probably a cafe, and postcard center, maybe gift a little shop. Uh, gift shop. Yeah. Yeah, we, could, uh, we could feature Alexis. Oh, is this this lettuce you were talking about? Uh-huh. Yes. Miner's lettuce. Yeah. Helps with irritable bowel syndrome. This one's nasturtium. Oh, excuse me. You can only tell by this little guy. A flower. Oh. You can eat this guy too, though. This is peppermint, no? Um, that's no. actually like a mustard uh, plant. Oh, is Those it? Those are like mustard greens. Yeah. Oh, wow. Gosh, you could have a whole great salad along here. Yes. <laughs> well, they intentionally planted it that way. Say again. This one is in the deadly nightshade family, so don't eat that one. <laughs> oh, here's California puppy. This is the state flower of California, the puppy. Okay. This is really beautiful right here. It's like to be Yeah, yeah, I think so.
I guess that would have been a little intense. Actually, we probably could go up that way. Nah, that's a long walk back. Oh, yeah, to, to get the to the car. Well, you yeah. can go up top. I can run over and grab it. No problem. So what is this, Monica, right here? I think it's some kind of acacia tree, but I'm not really sure. It looks like acacia because it has so much pollen on it. Mm. Okay. So it's funny from the... So from this, the, this always reminded me of Goonies. Okay, you want... That was shot. Uh, yeah, you want to tell me that for the camera? No, it's not really uh, like okay. factual. Okay. Let's go ahead. You remember the movie, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. So that was shot in Oregon. Uh-huh. Kind of has those like rocks on the other side. Yeah. And then they go in the cave and they make the stick. Oh, yeah, they find the pirate ship. <laughs> <laughs> they filmed Harold and Maude here. Have you seen that movie? Uh huh, I did, I That's filmed up the. Not about the homeless park people? No. The homeless guy? It's the old about lady. an old lady and a young man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, she's it, it's Gina, it's Gina Rollins. Okay. Yeah, but Gina Rollins isn't really that old, but she's an older woman. I know what she, she looks like. An old lady. In the movie. She's, oh, this. She plays a woman about to turn eighty. Oh, oh, okay. Train car. You know, I have seen it. It's cute. It's one of Monica's favorite films. Because she pictures herself as the old lady. Oh, yeah. <laughs> is that true? Yeah. Uh, parents living in a train trailer. Oh, I want to live in a train. <laughs> the idea of living in a train is cool. Right. All right. Yeah. <laughs> That's what happened with the others, too. Yeah, look, the moon's out. I see, I got that. I've gotten that. When so, that? where we're at now would have been the back and the back entrance to the suture bath. Okay. And so you know that glass structure? Right. That would have been right here. Oh wow. right in front of my camera and then oh gosh there he is there he is I can't see darn it sorry the camera probably got it yeah I'm pretty sure it did and we can go up there if you want on the way back up okay so just be careful this is all going to be loose okay so oh, that's a pretty cool shot <laughs> Down there that looks like, yeah, that looks like a, a heart cut out of that rock over there. Oh, yeah, nice. <laughs> so I can't, I shouldn't shoot right into the sun like that. It's not yeah, good for... Has a cool effect, anyway. Yeah, but it's not good for the lens. Like, wow, look at the restaurant. Look how far we've come. Yeah. It wasn't that bad, was it? No. Here we go. You should videotape us walking into the cave. Okay. This is the cave of wonders. Come with us. Now, this is going to be sandy in here. It's going to be shards. So that's what pebbles. You can see all the way through the cave. This should be easy for you to walk on. Huh? Oh, it's windy. Yeah. You doing okay? Yeah. So here's an observation platform. Does it, does it feel more sandy? Oh, there's a drop. 
No, actually it's not because, I mean, it's not too dark to follow you two. So why is this a platform? It's an observation platform. And what are you observing? The ocean. Look down in there and sometimes the water is falling underneath. Oh, I can one. see that. This one's the better one. Oh. Just watch the drop off right there. The platform stops. You okay? Yeah, come to me. Just hold on to the rail. I am. Yeah. And then just watch your step right now. I know. Okay. I'm looking down. Yep. I have the camera this okay. way, but I'm looking just down. Just making sure I can't really see you. <laughs> oh, yeah. Here's the big spot. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Yeah. I don't know, enlightened, I guess. <laughs> right. There's not too many places that you can go into a cave and see the ocean. Mm. And not drown. And not drown. And then that's a little hike down. but it looks like there's water. So we won't go all the way through. Well, let me have you two walk back, and I'll follow. Don't go too fast for me. <laughs> okay. This is pretty cool. Go ahead. You're like walking into the light. Come into the light, children. <laughs> I'm sliding down into the sand. Forget the light. <laughs> Oh, look at that for you. Okay. Hey, Monica, why don't you stand next to Joe and I'll shoot with that behind there, the heart shape. Dove pusher, dove pusher. Oh. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. uh, and then this does move. It does. Well, it scared her. Um, no, but I mean, I'm holding my elbow on there and you shook it like it. Oh, sorry. <laughs> so this would have been where they would have pumped in the water. Yeah, the pipeline. Uh, the the baths had salt water that was heated put into the pools. Yeah. So the restaurant. Okay. Yeah. All right. So this is the fancy restaurant out there? Yes. Okay. See now, maybe both of these restaurants might give you perks like for being involved in the show. Maybe so, maybe. You know, you could say next time that we get a, you get a monthly free meal or something. Okay. Now if you didn't want to do this jumble again, we could go to the right and then to the left like they're walking. Okay. Yeah, that's might be a little easier. Okay. It's longer, but it's easier. No, let's just go the way we came, because it's probably, I'll, I'll know as soon as I start up it, yeah. you know. And then what I want to do is zen it. If you let me zen it, I'll be fine. Thanks for coming.
coming along on this journey to Sutro Baths. Oh man! Squirreling and thoughts of swoops. This is the end of Bungo. This is the final part of Bungo to, to your left. To on my left. This is the beach. When you say the final part, you mean the San Francisco? Okay, Golden Gate Park. 